Hello everyone and good morning! If you are new here, my name is Matea. It is so nice to meet you. It is currently 7 a.m. and as if you might be able to tell from the intro, this is going to be my first vlog-alike video. Since everybody is slowly getting back to their routine, whatever that be, school or work, I thought it was the perfect time to make this video. I want to encourage you to take some time off of your routine for yourself. Take time to go to the gym, cook that meal, relax after a long day of work. You are indeed going to feel the difference. So without further ado, let's get started. This video is going to be all about my favorites, food and training. So let's start off by making some coffee. Since I am a well-known coffee lover, I often get questions on how I prepare my coffee. So here is all the magic. First off, I heat the water until it is boiling. Then I remove it to the side to add the coffee. I always opt for 4 teaspoons of coffee. As much as I try, I almost always manage to spill it everywhere. Especially when I'm doing it with one hand, like now. Then I return it until it boils again and repeat the same thing three times. Then I leave it to settle down a little bit and it is ready to enjoy. This can be quite a struggle. <laughs> Just as I said in my What I Eat In A Day video, I always start my day with a cup of black coffee and some sweetener. Perfect. I'm also sipping on quite a bit of water to hydrate my body after a long night of sleep and also to get myself up and running in the morning. It is now time to plan out my day. For that, I like to use my planner to actually keep on top of my responsibilities. Then I grab my phone for the first time to plan my meals for the day. You can find all the details on how I plan my meals and how I calorie count in my previous video, which will be linked down below and also on the screen. Well, since I'm training today, I'm going to have what I consider a bigger breakfast. I'm going to make a protein smoothie, which I'm going to mix with my oats and some almonds to keep me fuller for longer and also to give me energy while still being very rich in protein. Not to even mention how tasty it is. Oh my God, I love it the most. You can also change it up so easily by just switching fruits or the flavor of your protein powder. I'm now ready to hop on in my gym clothes and head to the gym. I like to take a bike ride to the gym whenever possible. It is perfect to set the mood and warm up at the same time. I had quite an intense lower body training scheduled with my coach today. First, a little mobility routine consisting of 4 exercises with 10 reps each. Then, for the main part, I started off with a sumo deadlift. I did 3 sets, 8 reps with 55 kilograms each. Following with hip thrust, which I also did 3 sets, 12 reps with 70 kilograms.
To really finish off those glutes and quads, I did a super set of two exercises. I did three sets of cable CC squat and lying leg curl. That leg curl really hits differently, don't underestimate it. After that, I did one set of lunges just to use that remaining strength. That was it for the lower body. And after that, I did two more sets of cable crunches. I try to incorporate at least some type of core exercise in every workout I do, because a solid core is necessary to perform almost any exercise correctly. Shortly after arriving home from the gym, I had some meetings planned, so I just quickly snacked on some watermelon and headed out. Just as I finished my meetings, I headed off to my episode favorite restaurant to grab the lunch. I literally get the same order every time I go there because it is so perfect. I had a Caesar salad with a sweet potato on the side. I took some time to relax and enjoy my afternoon espresso. Well, hello once again. I just finished my dinner. I had some chicken breasts and potatoes. This is the option I almost always aim for if I'm eating out because you do not have to plan where you are going to eat. Pretty much any restaurant has it. It is not expensive and it is a great source of protein and it is also very tasty. This was actually an unexpected visit to the center. Uh, I had to do some stuff uh, and I had to return so I didn't have any food with me because it all just happened so quickly and yeah I was already quite a bit hungry when I finished everything I had to do so I just grabbed a quick dinner. Right now I'm going to go home, I have some editing to do and some other stuff and uh, I'm also learning Final Cut Pro now because I want to level up my videos and make them more enjoyable for you. That's it for now, let's go home and see you there! Hello once again, it is now a few hours later. I did some editing and some coding, so the time just flew by. It is now 11 p.m. and I'm ready to relax and get ready for bed. I wanted this video to be as realistic as possible, just to show you that even with a busy lifestyle, you can squeeze in the trainings and even with eating out, you can stay healthy and on track. That is it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did, be sure to leave a like because it really helps the channel grow. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. Until next time, bye!